My name's Scott Delaney and I'm an assistant construction manager. Working as an assistant construction manager is organising buildings from start to finish. Uh, but that encompasses everything within the building, so that's the drainage, all the power, all the utilities that come into the building. You as a construction manager have to get involved and have a basic knowledge of what's going on. Funnily enough, I, I've always enjoyed sciences at school uh, and, and, and was interested in those subjects. But it wasn't my passion. In actual fact, my passion was more creative in doing like artistic subjects and, uh, and subjects around that nature. I didn't really know what I wanted to do at school. And, and the focus for me was, because I didn't know, was to carry on with my education. And I progressed to do my A-levels. And it, it, still at A-level, I, I, the careers advice I got was to actually just pick subjects you like. Um, I chose art-related subjects and I, I chose classics and I did history and things like that, which didn't automatically lend itself to construction where I found myself. I completed my A-levels and I was destined to go to university, but I decided not to go. And I actually ended up uh, starting work. At that moment in time in my life, I needed to earn money and I wanted to, to be independent. I actually became a market trader and owned my own business. Um, and I did that for a number of years. It was, it was good. I enjoyed it for, for that period of time, it was good for where I was, but I, I, didn't, I, I always had a hunger for something else and I don't know if it was a hunger for education or a, a hunger to, to move on and inevitably that's what I did. I, I then made a decision to actually go travelling, so I actually packed my bags and uh, went backpacking in, in uh, Australia, uh, enabled me to really be independent, uh, but also a good life experience, good qualities, meeting people, uh, seeing a new country, different culture. Um, so I, I took a lot from my time in Australia. Whilst I was travelling, I was doing a lot of construction work. I knew from, the, from those jobs that I actually enjoyed this kind of work. I enjoyed the environment. I didn't mind the weather. I didn't mind being outside. The problems, the camaraderie, you know, those are the things that that, that experience actually gave me. When I came back, I, needed, I, I got myself into a situation where I needed to earn money. So what I decided to do was go and be a black cab driver. So I ended up driving black cabs for a number of years when I came back for, from Australia. It was a means to an end for me um, because I needed the money. But at the same time, I always had this hankering to do something. I didn't know necessarily what I needed to do, but when I did focus in, I sat in the cab one day and thought, actually, I, I want to develop a career and I want to move into a field where, you know, it's challenging. I actually thought about construction. I thought this is the, that was the time when I was at my happiest and I really enjoyed it. And that's when I did my research into the degrees that were necessary to, to get me on the courses. Once I started the research, it became quite clear that you know, construction management was available for me. And because I'd done my A-levels, I was in a very fortunate position because I didn't have to do any additional studying. I could just apply, I filled in the application form, and I knew very quickly whether I would be accepted or not. And I got onto the course and I started straight away. Delving back into the learning experience was quite a shock because uh, you've got to learn how to take notes and listen and you know, know when to take notes down and when, when to ignore things. But it's just a learning process. The first year is there to help you. And uh, I found the people I was dealing with on the course and the tutors were more than helpful to what I wanted. The university I went to had a semester basis where you get four months off every summer. So in the, in the summer, I put myself out there and I approached different construction companies to actually get summer placements so I could get that experience whilst I was studying. Once I got on site, I, I realised I'd definitely made the right decision and it just confirmed everything I thought about the job and the role. The, the nature of construction is, is that it's very diverse and that there are a number of different roles that are within the industry that you can go into. Um, I don't see myself doing this role for the rest of my career, but I do see myself working within construction. I, you know, we go through life and I went through life thinking that there are barriers in, the way, in your way to, to certain roles and, and maybe certain jobs. But the only barriers that are there are the ones you make yourself. In actual fact, if you, if you, you know, apply yourself and do the hard work, then in reality, there's nothing that you can't achieve.